Betting there will be a few more cups before she leaves. Some things never change. Sam, I didn't think you'd actually show up. I didn't think I would either. But hey, sometimes we surprise ourselves. So, uh, I hear you got in a fight after I left the wake? I was so wasted at that point, it's all just a big, heavy blur. Yeah. After saying I didn't want to drink, I went home and drank. Long night. Yeah. Sounds about right. We all deal with stress in our own ways. I apparently hit Dennis. Yeah, speaking of, you haven't seen him today, have you? Why? Afraid your powerful blows laid him up? So, what are you working on? <laughs> I'm working on an article on how nature does its best to reclaim the land after a strip mining operation. Why are you looking for Dennis? I can tell something has you spooked. I can always tell. Go on. Tell her. You could honestly use a non-imaginary person to confide in. She might slow me down. Or try to involve the cops. She might do those things, yes, or she might be someone who you can trust, who can help. I woke up today and my shirt was covered in blood. Blood? What happened? I don't know. Last night, pills and alcohol mixed. It's all a blur. That's why I'm looking for Dennis. Have you tried the Basswood Jungle? He likes to work weekends. No, not yet. I'll do that right now. Sam, is there anything I can do to help? Oh, uh, nah. I'm just gonna do my own thing. <laughs> oh, Sam. What have you done? Seems Walter's got a lot on his mind. I know the feeling. Samuel! Samuel, my young soul, are you still haunting this pallid town? Walter, you haven't seen Dennis today, have you? Can't say I have. I hear you got into quite a tussle. Quite the tussle. Nothing other than that? You should try the Basswood Jungle Office. I've known him to go in on Sundays. He may be a prickly pear, a very prickly pear, but he's dedicated. If he says something will be done Monday, come the devil or come the rain, it is. I'll keep that in mind. Thanks. You know, I'm glad I ran into you. If I may bend your ear for a moment. I've been thinking lately about age, life, the turn of the clock. No one gets sharper with age. When do you think it's time to hang up the saddle? A true cowboy rides until the last day they can ride. I had a feeling you'd say that. I have a lot to think about. Thank you for your ear, but soon I must have sconed. Sunday lunch with mother is sacred. Call on me anytime, young Samuel. Anytime. Locked. I should check the back. My, my, my. Look what we got here. Is that Sam Higgs? Trying to get back in the newspaper game? I thought you got the message last night. Of course, it was hard to tell. Considering you let Declan do your talking for you. Look, fellas. You know, Basswood can be a dangerous place. Well, so maybe consider just getting before something bad happened to you.
I'll leave when I'm good and ready. Just make it sooner rather than later. De Declan's right down the street. Watch yourself while you're in Basswood, because we'll be watching you. Been a while. This place used to be my home, or at least felt like it. Where is Dennis? He should be in here. Dennis! Is that how I got blood on me? Did I? Sam, when you focus, you can think through any problem. Keep going. You got this. Don't give up, Sam. You almost have it. This is Dennis's office. There must be some clues around. Come on, Sam, keep it together. You can solve this. Figure this out before Dennis dies again and the panic overwhelms you. Chest wound. What kind of weapon did this? to go on. I need something useful. The chair is pretty far away from the desk, but I don't think that's important. Gunshot. The bullet went... Sam, stop it! Come back to reality! But I... I... You didn't do anything! Dennis was already dead when you arrived, can't you see? Dennis was shot, and you don't even own a gun. How could you have done it? All you did was move his body, which is how your shirt got stained. Think about it, Sam. Calm down and think. You're... You're right. I can see it.
I have the complete picture now. Blood on the shirt was Dennis's, but I didn't kill him. I found him dead. Blackout drunk, panicked. I stumbled to my car. Luckily, I ended up back at the hotel and not wrapped around a pole. Now, I know I didn't do it. The police, though, may not feel the same way. I need to search the area. See if I can find out why someone would murder Dennis. I need to find out why Dennis was killed. It may have something to do with Nick. Dennis's computer is still signed in. Seems like a good place to start. You didn't deserve this. No one deserves this. Emails between Nick and Dee. They're talking in codes. Nothing stated clearly. They didn't want to risk anyone learning of their meetings. Smart. Someone was watching. Whatever Nick was looking into seemed big, but he said it fizzled out. puzzle comes together. Dennis was reading everyone's emails. He found out that Nick hadn't stopped his investigation like he'd told Walter. And that Nick was still talking to some informant. Then he decided to tell me. And now he's dead. I need to look through any notes Nick left in his office and check Walter's computer. They have to have something for me to go on. Nick must have left some notes behind somewhere. And Walter also might have something on Nick's work. I should look around.
might be something around here that hints at Walter's password. Ugh. My heart's desire. It could mean a person, but also a place. Ugh. My heart's desire. It could mean a person, but also a place. There might be something around here that hints at Walter's password. Walter was never tech-savvy, he just uses words that mean something to him. There's a good chance there's a clue in his office.